As the World Defense Show, WDS, 2024 unfolds in Saudi Arabia, Turkish Aerospace Industries, TAI, is displaying the Bayraktar Akinci. The first unmanned combat aerial vehicle, UCAV, ordered by Saudi Arabia in July 2023 is expected to be delivered by the year 2026. Equipped with dual artificial intelligence avionics, the ACNC supports real-time signal processing, sensor fusion, and situational awareness. It features advanced systems including electronic support systems, dual satellite communication systems, air-to-air -air radar, collision avoidance radar, and synthetic aperture radar. Designed to perform operations typically carried out by fighter jets, it serves as a versatile asset for both air-to-ground and air-to-air -air attack missions. Its triple redundant electronics and software systems enable it to carry a wide range of payloads, including smart munitions, guided bombs, missiles, and deterrence weapons. Additionally, it will be equipped with a multifunctional ESA radar system for air-to-air -air combat and synthetic weather estimation. In terms of flight performance, the ACNC boasts impressive capabilities, including a maximum flight altitude of 40,000 feet and up to 24 hours of flight time. It features fully automatic flight control, automatic takeoff and landing capabilities without dependence on ground systems, as well as precise auto takeoff and landing with integrated sensor fusion. With a payload capacity of 1,500 kg, it can simultaneously carry a diverse range of ISR payloads and munitions. He's being presented at the show with several Rakhazan smart munitions, including MAM C, MAM L, and MAM T, under the starboard wing, twin racks with a Selsentalian munitions on the center pylon and MAM-C, MAM-L, alongside a Rakhez Antibur and a Selsun LGK-250 munitions under the port wing. Several other missiles are currently being integrated onto the Akinsi, including the Som cruise missile and Kakir cruise missile. The Bayraktar Akink is operated from a ground control station equipped with radio systems, pilot consoles, payload operator consoles, and image exploitation consoles. It utilizes triple bands for line of sight, LOS, control and video transmission, with beyond line of sight, BLOS, operations supported via satellite communication, SATCOM. BLOS operations can be conducted over existing worldwide satellite networks, and SATCOM data terminals can be provided as needed. A new ASELSAN active electronically scanned array, AESA, radar is expected to follow soon. According to the latest available data, the Bayraktar Act has been sold to four countries including Turkey, Pakistan, Libya, and Ethiopia. Furthermore, Azerbaijan and Kyrgyzstan have expressed their intention to acquire it for their air force.